the Black Max uh, Honda GCV 160 fits perfect in the trunk of this Camry I just had to take the handle off to see back there it just snaps right on with these little push pins so let's get it out and we will uh, see what we've got here here's a better look now of the uh, Black Max 2600 PSI 2.3 gallon per minute pressure washer this is uh, powered by the Honda GCV 160 engine and uh, it's supposed to be a really quiet engine as most people probably know these uh, Hondas are very reliable usually easy to start uh, this is supposed to have a um, lifetime timing belt so that's uh, hopefully that'll be something I won't have to worry about you know it is four stroke just to use regular gas and um, oil separately uh, it looks really clean other than just you know some cobwebs and some dust wheels don't look like they've been used that much of course I have no idea how it has been used uh, there is no wand or hose that would be right here so uh, I'm gonna have to provide that myself somehow I think I've got an extra one um, let's take a look at the oil yeah it's, uh, it's actually got more than uh, we need uh, I will change that I may try to start it before I change it very clean it's not really rusty other than right here on the pipe how clean that is I mean okay here's where we can adjust the valves if we ever need to spark plug is in a very good place here easy to get to access Port looks practically brand new here. Starter recoil seems to be very good. Let's check the gas. I know it had a little bit of gas in it. Uh, they left the gas line on. I can't really, I can see there's gas in there, but I can't really tell what it looks like. We're going to drain all that. But yeah, they left it on. I just turned it in the off position, so there's no telling how long it's been um, on going to the carburetor. Hopefully it's not uh, all gunked up. Oh, that filter looks pretty nice. Don't know if that's original or not. Look at that. That is awesome. It's completely dry here. That is incredible. So we got our on off button right here. Um, you know, fuel cut off. doesn't have an automatic choke we pull this out when starting and then once it gets you know once it starts push it in got our uh, soap uh, tank here this is where the hose will go on doesn't really look like it's too worn to those threads still got our screen here where we will uh, put our supply line or garden hose two thousand nine all right yeah pretty stoked about it so far we're going to go ahead and drain that fuel put some new fuel in there and try to start it for the first time real curious to see what that gas looks like so let's go ahead and 
try to get this line off. See, there's our filter. Wasn't much gas at all, just shoot, I don't know. That was like, it's got some, it's got some contaminants in it, I can see, but it's like a quarter of a cup or half cup of gas that was in the tank. I'm going to put fresh gas in it here and we're going to give it a first time start. We've got the fuel line on. My biggest fear in this is that um, that old gas has been sitting in here for who knows how long with the line on going to the carburetor. You know, may have, uh, may have dirtied up the carburetor so much that uh, it won't run, it won't run good and I'll need to go in there and clean it up. Real simple starting instructions. All we're going to do is put it in on position, turn the gas on, um, pull this choke, pull it till it starts, and then we'll push that in. Okay, I'm going to need some starter fluid, it looks like. Can't find my starter fluid. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing over again here.
while the Honda is still warm, I think I'm going to go ahead and change the oil. And yeah, there's no um, there's no plug, so we're going to have to you know pull the unit to the side and drain it that way. All right, not too bad. Uh, oil's pretty black. Sorry I wasn't able to set the camera up where you could see that coming out, but um, yeah, I mean, it's not horrible. But we will uh, replace this with uh, 10W30. Oil capacity for this is 0.58 quarts, which is, um, you know, it's a little more than a half a quart. I think it's like around 17, 18 ounces, and um, that's dry, so you know we won't be able to put that much in. Um, so yeah, let me grab some oil, I'm thinking maybe 12 ounces or something like that. Starting out with about 10 ounces. Let that settle and we'll check it. All right, on the cross hatch, you can see it's a little, a little higher than it should be. Yeah, much better. It's right at the high mark on the cross hatch. So we're going to go with that. All right, we got water going to the pump from our uh, water supply, which is a garden hose. Uh, we're going to uh, turn the gas on going to put it in on pull the choke out to start it once it does start and we'll push it in and uh, we should be good I don't even know if I told you the price um, 20 half of that so it's like 20 bucks
So that does it for the Honda GCV 160. I think it's a pretty good engine. Uh, starts easy. Four stroke, you know, should be easy to maintain. Quiet. I think I'm going to like it. Thanks for watching the video. Till next time, have a nice day. Take care.